Hi, this is Brian DeCord, Stop and Goaltending. Today we're going to talk a little bit about rebound control and the use of the blocker. We used to work a lot on making sure we get that puck right into the corner. Then we've got that 12 inch shot that really hurts goaltenders. It's a popular shot right now. The pad's 11 inches in the butterfly just over that pad. We want to make sure that we're getting the face of the blocker getting on top of the puck. One of the little rules that I like to use is a pinky squeeze. That means instead of being concerned about rolling the wrist over, we just take our pinky and we just squeeze a little bit. If we squeeze our pinky, it'll change the angle of the blocker. The puck hits the blocker, goes to where we want it to go. If you take a look at it with my blocker on, if I squeeze the pinky, guess what happens? That's all we're looking for. We're not looking for that big rotation and turning the blocker over because I'll show you what happens next. So when a goaltender's in the butterfly with a low shot, if we're getting into that rolling the wrist and turning our blocker over, we're exposing net. We've learned a little bit about box control. What we want to do is fill the box. So we're going to take that stick, a little pinky, pressure with the pinky, we get the angle, and then we drop that blocker right on top of the puck so that the full face is being used and it's the angle of the blocker that's directing it into the corner. Now we're going to take a look at some live shots and a real goalie making the saves. So you got a chance to see a good goalie making blocker saves. One thing you got to think about is when that puck is just out of that reach and you've got to go get it, don't be afraid to punch it in the face. This is Brian Accord, Stop at Goaltending. Good luck this weekend, guys.